The last step is moisturizer. Um, I use this Neutrogena Oil Free Moisturizer. I'm saying the name of the moisturizer because I know that people struggle for the moisturizer. And personally, this has been the best moisturizer I've been using so far. A really good one is CeraVe, and I think that's better. Like it works with majority of skin, majority of the skin types. But I use the um, CeraVe PM one. Or the night but i use it at any time of the day but right now i'm using the neutrogena oil free moisturizer for sensitive skin it it gives me a glow without really making me look oily and listen i have seen so many celebrities so many people talking about oh my moisturizer just gives me a glow and it doesn't make my skin and i just i couldn't find one moisturizer that could do that for me so when they kept on saying that i'm just like them lie because Put so much moisturizer now we do the makeup so unfortunately when i decide to record this video my eyebrows are a mess okay so first thing we're doing is brows i use eyeshadow to do my brows Okay, so now we're gonna continue the brows. LA Pro Brow Concealer. Um, it's very affordable, does the job. We're gonna blend out the concealer with a dry beauty blender. It's not a beauty blender, it is a beauty sponge by AOA. I believe that's the brand does the job let me tell you something there are really good sponges out there that don't have to be in the beauty blender although never owned a beauty blender in my life i'm not knocking them i think they're the og props to them but i'm just saying you don't have to get a beauty blender to have your makeup blended properly i'm using this shade all over my lid and i'm just like, it's all 
now i'm going to conceal so i am going to just use the same shade use the same shade of concealer and go underneath my eyes and use the same beauty blender and blend out that concealer I look i just go for concealer alone and i do it directly where i have my problem areas i don't need any further than that i don't go down here i because i'm so same sponge dry blending this out Alright, so now we've done concealer slash correcting and now we're gonna bake. So I bake with the such a buttercup. I'm just gonna tap. So with the same palette, I'm going to con the same palette that I used for my eyebrows. I'm going to contour with that. So going into going into this shade, it's gonna warm up my face. Some on the forehead. Although my forehead is pretty tan because <laughs> it's so big, it's the first thing that you know the sun catches. So, to be honest, I don't need to bronze anything on my forehead. But just for it to have the same kind of hue slash tint slash temperature terms slash temperature whatever, I just put it there. I don't go on my jawline because I have a pretty good jawline. Now, going into my favorite, favorite thing to do, blush. So what I do is I go on the cheeks, right? I do a high blush. I truly just put blush everywhere. Love looking like a sunburnt girl. We love a sun, a sunburn girl. We love a sunburn, and then put some on my nose, the bridge of my nose, my chin, my forehead, and then we're just gonna blend that out. Blend all of these out. I'm going to set this first because i have a jawline but i really don't really i think i kind of don't have any cheekbones so to give my my cheeks a little snatch i go in with my And now I do my under eyes. It feels more normal. Now I'm going to brush away this. So brushing away all of this. Using the excess powder to blend in my blush, my bronzer, everything. I am going to do my eyeliner. Um, I can't talk for this. So, we're going to just en enjoy the silence. So now mascara. It's 
See, I don't look that crazy now, do I? Then I go in with highlight. So first I do the inner corners. I just put some powder in my eyes. I'm not going to go on to my hair, I'm not going to go on to my car. I'm done do all of this makeup for, for, my, for my hair also. And then I go in with a larger brush and I do the Rihanna method. Where she puts highlight on her cheeks. And not only her cheeks, but her eyebrow. So I line my lips with a brown liner. I go in with a gloss. Now I don't really like my gloss to be overly glossy, so I usually put some on my wrist. And I tap my lips so I get like an even coat of gloss and then we're almost done I spray my face with Mario Mario Badescu skin Mario Mario Badescu skin what the heck Mario Badescu skincare Facial spray with aloe, herbs, and rose water. Okay. This is the final look. Again, my name is Carmen Elena, aka Chelita. Please like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you can know when I post another video. Um, I hope you liked this video. It was very fun for me to do. I hopefully who knows one day it's actually with vogue who knows who knows hopefully that'd be so cool um yeah later thanks for watching again i guess <laughs> okay i feel like i'm forgetting something oh follow um on my social media Everything is at the Carmen Elena, T H E C A R M E N E L E N A. And uh, everything will be linked down below in the description box. Thank you. Thanks for watching. <laughs>